Niall quit the ITV2 series without explanation last month and later opened up to fans about his Asperger's diagnosis he'd previously kept hidden. In an emotional post to Instagram, Niall revealed he credits Love Island for helping him finally accept the condition, and now he is hoping to help others like him. Niall said he wants to use his time on the show to help other people with Asperger's syndrome. Image, Lexi Jones slash when.com, I've started writing a book actually about what I've been through in my experience, he told The Sun at his first public experience since opening up to fans. I want to put out a positive message and if I can help one person who has been in the same position as me then that's great. I hope that people can embrace themselves more, and once you've embraced yourself you can cope better, he added, I've started it off my own back and it's helping, Niall and fellow Love Island contestant Rosie reunite for the Harry Potter quiz image, Lexi Jones slash when.com, last week Niall was inundated with praise for opening up about his Asperger's condition. For far too long I have suffered in silence and not acknowledged a massive fact about my life which going into the villa has led me to finally realize and accept, he wrote in the post. Niall was praised for his honest Instagram post, when I was a young child I was diagnosed with Asperger's syndrome, a fact that until this post has never shared outside of my close family. Growing up was extremely difficult for me and I often felt out of place. I always felt that people didn't understand me, yet I was afraid to reveal my true scales as I did not want the label or stigma that was attached to it. Danny Dyer won't appear in Love Island Villa for surprising reason, he went on, but now I think it is important that I come forward, not only so that I can finally be honest with myself and to those around me, but also so that other individuals in my position can embrace their true colors. It's not been an easy ride for me to come to terms with this fact but I am glad that I can now accept who I am, and am looking forward to my next chapter. I would just like to thank the team at ITV for always backing me and giving me the opportunity to rid my myself of my insecurities and embrace the fact that I am different yet I am still a rainbow fish. I can't explain how grateful I am for the support from the whole team over this period. Niall praised his mum for her support. Love Island viewers furious with Josh for rolling his eyes at Heartbroken Georgia before Paris showdown, he added. I would also like to thank the British public for the love you have all shown me over the past few weeks. It has been overwhelming. Now it's time for this rainbow fish to dive deep into the big blue ocean and show the world what I'm all about. There's more layers to come. After his brave admission, Rosie told Mirror Online how concerns were sparked when Niall disappeared from the villa without a word. She said he'd been acting, unusually, on his last day there, but the islanders were only told he'd left and wasn't coming back. Asterisk Love Island continues tonight at 9pm on ITV2. Page 2 Love Island's Megan Barton Hansen is addicted to plastic surgery and only dates men who can buy her extravagant gifts, an ex-colleague of the former stripper has claimed. The 24-year-old blonde bombshell, who the mirror revealed last week has had £25,000 worth of plastic surgery on her face and body, is only in the show for fame and fortune, says her ex-pal. I think she is addicted to surgery now she's had so much work done. It does get addictive especially when you start at such a young age. I believe her dad paid for the majority of it the unnamed source told Heat World. Megan's ex-mate claims she used sugar daddies to buy her presents. Image, Rex, Megan, who used to work as a stripper, has undergone a dramatic transformation over the last few years. Image, Facebook, I'm not shocked at all by her behavior. She's a very fake girl, very bitchy and can come across quite stuck up as well. She's always seeking male attention and she doesn't have many female friends. I think she's more interested in making money than having a social life. Megan caused a stir as soon as she arrived in the villa, setting her sights on Isle Booker and being the first couple to have full sex in the series. She then broke hearts across the nation when she confessed her feelings to Wes Nelson, resulting in him dumping original partner Laura Anderson to pursue things with Megan. 
Meghan is rumored to have had 25,000 pounds of surgery, image, Facebook, she now works as a model, image, supplied by when, but once Wes had left the villa for Casa Amor, Meg's head was turned by the arrival of six new boys. First up was honky Alex Miller, who managed to get into Meghan's bed straight away. They kissed early on, but Meg shocked the whole villa when she turned her attention to Dean and snogged him in front of everyone. However, it was lucky Alex who Meghan picked to couple up with leaving West Devo when he arrived back at the original villa on his lonesome, having stayed loyal to Meghan while he was away. Meghan was branded muggy by viewers, image, ITV picture desk, she's got no qualms about showing off her body, image, ITV, and Meghan's ex-friend says her behavior in the villa isn't shocking, as she uses men for presents. She dates boys to buy her gifts. She's had a few sugar daddies, said the insider, who claimed Meg once dated a bouncer from her strip club but dumped him because he didn't have much money. And on the subject of her plastic surgery, which includes a rumored nose job, white veneers, a boob job, possible Brazilian bum lift, Botox and lip fillers, the source also claims Megan has had work done on her vagina, leaving her colleagues in shock. Megan and Rosie did a sexy photo shoot in the villa, image, supplied by when Megan is now coupled up with Alex Miller, image, ITV picture desk, she has spoiled brat syndrome, if Megan wants, Megan gets. She is definitely in it for the money and the fame, they added. Mirror Online has contacted ITV reps for comment. Asterisk Love Island continues tonight at 9pm on ITV2.